I'm here with the Chuck Gomes, the chair of the GNSO PDP Working Group on the Next Generation Registration Directory Service to replace who is. So Chuck, can you provide us a little background of this PDP? Well, this PDP has lots of history behind it. Most of ICANN's history has involved some working groups or efforts with regard to who is, which we're now referring to as registration data services. Uh, and it's been a frustrating area because there are very diverse interests with regard to who is and registration data. Uh, so uh, it's not as if we're starting from scratch. A lot of work has gone into this over the years uh, with not a lot of success because of the divergent positions that different groups within the community have. And all of those groups have good valid positions. So finding some common ground is a challenge. Fortunately, in this particular case, the ICANN board uh, uh, initiated the expert working group that did a lot of great work. Now, the expert working group was not a policy development body like uh, the GNSO is, uh, and they specifically were not uh, tasked with developing policy, but they did a, a lot of great work and a lot of just really sharp people provided a lot of information that this working group can use along with the other work that many people over the years have done. So we didn't really start from zero, but we started from a very a tough, on a very tough issue. Indeed. And uh, we heard that the working group has reached rough consensus on 26 initial points related to the user's access, um, the purpose and data elements in the, con in the context of the same data. So yesterday we had a cross-community discussion on this topic. How did the wider ICANN community react to these uh, key concepts? Well, I, I think it depends on, on who you're talking about. Those who have a lot of history on this issue probably had a very different reaction than some of the newer people to it. Uh, some of the feedback I've received is some of the newer people, it was very informative for them, and they had no idea the level of complexity of the issues we're dealing with or the different nuances that come into play, and I think that session illustrated that for them. For some of the old timers or the people who work with who is and registration directory data uh, every day, uh, probably wasn't as enlightening for them, but they certainly had opportunity to contribute. So in general, do you think the cross-community discussion was helpful in furthering the PDP? Uh, from the PDP point of view, yes, I do. Uh, I, th I think as a working group, we received some good feedback. For example, you mentioned the 26 uh, key concepts that we've reached tentative agreement on. Uh, what we found in the uh, working group on the majority of those, the sense we got from the room uh, was pretty much the same level of, of, of support and objection that we received in the working group. Uh, there was one item in particular, maybe two, where there was a little bit different sense and that was helpful. So that'll, that'll help guide us as we continue our work. And uh, I know the working group going to meet on Wednesday for a three-hour working session. What do you aim to accomplish? Well, one of the things, since we've been talking about the uh, cross-community session yesterday, is we will do a brief follow-up on that and, and let the people know how we're going to use that information and move forward. But what we're really hoping to do as a main objective in the working group meeting this week is to start deliberating on uh, a new area of registration data, 
for the last several months, we've been focusing on what used to be referred to as thin data, and some people still use that term. We're using a term different than that now. Uh, and uh, we're hoping tomorrow to start actually going beyond that into some of the what we often call as thick data, some uh, contact information. And uh, so we're, we're kind of excited about that because a lot of people within the working group, a lot of our members, have been wanting us to get beyond the thin data into the thick data, and th that's our main objective tomorrow. Great. And um, also, you may know about the RDS review. Do you think this review will have an impact on this uh, ongoing PDP work? It, it could. Uh, one of the tasks that they have, as I understand it, is to take a look at what we're doing and see if they can make some recommendations to how we could be more efficient. We're cer we certainly welcome that. Definitely. So the last question is, um, going be looking beyond Johannesburg, what do you think will be the next for this uh, PDP? Well, our, our goal by ICANN 60 is to be ready to start working on our first initial report. And that's aggressive, uh, but I think that uh, we have a shot at, at being ready to do that, and we'd really like to do that because uh, it would be excellent to show that progress. That's great. We're looking forward to uh, seeing the progress, and thank you very much, Chuck. Enjoy the rest of your meeting. You're welcome.